Hello guys, hope you're all doing well. Today I'm going to show you how to replace an old flue hole in brickwork. Hope you learned something. So first we need to identify the bricks that we're going to need to replace and you can see clearly here that this needs replacing. This one, this one, this one and this one. So total of one, two, three, four, five bricks need replacing. All right, so what we're going to do first is with a grinder is to make cuts in the bed joints. Okay, above each brick that needs replacing. So here, all the way across to there. This one, this one, this one, this one, this one and this one. Okay, I'll do that now. Well, let's get our PPE on. We've got our stuff ready. We've got our PPE on, ready to go. Got our steel saw, connect to the water. There we go. All right, so now we have made the horizontal cuts. We'll just make an incision on the verticals where we need, okay? That'll just help us when we're taking the bricks out. And that's that, that's sorted. This is a stonemason's chisel. The picture and this is just a, a lump hammer which is from footprint. Basically we're going to start at the top and we need to get this brick out and work downwards. So when you're taking bricks out as well you need to make sure that all this is taken out, all the old joints. Okay folks, so you can see now that we've cleaned everything off and all the old mortar off the old bricks. We've taken out every single brick that we said we was going to take out, all the damaged ones, so we can put our nice new fresh ones back. Alright? So when we're taking them out, or when I take them out, I start from top to bottom. And when I put them back in, obviously you've got to start from bottom to top. Okay, so he's made a good mix, I hope. Have you? You know I have. You know I have, he said. Basically we're just iron the top of that with that, that course and that without course. Trying our best. Next one.
That's all you can do, isn't it? You have to get it up first. Final brick, so you angle it. We've got a couple of wiggles. KC Minion. They called you Minion, didn't they? You look like a minion though with that man. When you're taking the motor off, just hold your trowel to the sky, get your joint to, to the sky again, easy. Try and follow it to catch any droppings. You looking all right? Yeah, good. Good answer. Right, so we've gone over it now, filled it in both sides. We've done our verticals and our horizontals. Now we need to do something called tucking in. It's these bits here, mouse's ears they're called. Just go over them again to tuck them in. And just neaten everything up. See how it just tidies it up a little bit. And there we have it. That's the finished 
voila. Not looking too bad. And that's it, finished job, looks okay. These jobs quite patchy, so if you're having a go for yourself, good luck if you're a plumber. But yeah, you can do it. Anyway, thanks for watching, see you in the next one, cheers.